Hi, you guys. Welcome back to Cupcake Art. Who gives a fuck? Today, we're going to be trying this. Um, Today, I'm not going to be doing a mukbang and I'm not going to be eating. So, today, we're going to be trying this Italian pasta salad. It consists of parsley. Um, it consists of basil. It consists of olives. These are diced olives. Um, it consists of mozzarella balls, two matums, Italian dressing, and I wanted to do something different. So instead of just putting um, everything in, I mean, I wanted to do something different. So instead of just putting everything into like, um, into one container and doing it like that i wanted to add shrimp to it so i added shrimp now i have a pound of shrimp i got these for ten dollars at um they were at Publix. i got them for ten dollars or whatever so you could do the same so we're going to boil our noodles which are these noodles the tri-colored noodles i think when you do this salad the tri-colored noodles it could just be me but i truly and really feel like the tri-colored noodles like it makes the food more colorful it makes it more exciting it just makes it more better to me and then we're missing a purple onion and a bell pepper so what i'm going to do is i'm going to take you guys over here with me while i cut up the bell pepper and the um the purple onion and the bell pepper and then we're going to put these in, in the water to boil so as we put these in the water to boil, i'm going to take you guys with me sorry for shaking my girls are sleeping how is quarantine going for you guys it's going good for me so as you could see i have my water here it's a boiled and um it's boiling so now that i have the water boiling we're gonna we're gonna open this and we're just gonna place the box the noodles i'm gonna see this right here that looks crappy. Let's put you guys right there. Right. We're gonna open this up. I always thought this was like really nice because of the colors and everything. So yeah. I already boiled one, but I was like, that's not gonna really be enough for all of us. So I'll make another one. Put salt. come out and you just want to stir it up we're gonna let this boil now oh i'm sorry okay there you guys go so we're gonna let that boil but if you come over here i've already boiled some and the ones that i've boiled um, they're right here. These are the ones that I boiled already. So I'm just going to take them and put them in here like this. This is like a little container I got from Super Bowl. And then, um, on the instructions, it says that you are supposed to, um, cut the tomatoes. So I'm going to cut, rinse them off. I'm going to cut them off. I never did this type of video before, so I hope you guys understand if it comes out good. But I know the salad is definitely going to be good. So let me yeah, direct you guys down like that. So we're going to put this right here. I'm also going to put this to the side as well. Put that right here. I think I'm missing the bell pepper. And I'm gonna get some gloves. 
So how are you guys doing? I have a big bag of um, rice right there. So yeah, I pray you guys enjoy this video. I pray you that your family is okay, everyone is okay. And I pray you guys are doing well. It's kind of crazy times. I was talking to my um, my sister earlier today. I was telling her like, I'm so blessed. I'm happy that God allowed me the time to be here. Not to also have my mother, but my children. You know, you don't want your children to go through a time like this alone. So this is a purple onion. Now the, mind you, I'm going to drop the description of the salad below, but I want you to also know that I'm doing my own thing. So I'm going to provide the ingredients for you guys and I'm going to do it until my liking. But you have all the ingredients. We have all the ingredients. Now, I like my food to be like, I have on gloves because I don't want to cry. I'm going to stand up because it gives me a little more, you know, like. <laughs> I don't know, girl. I'm just really trying to get this. Um, I'm trying not to come out of quarantine. You know, I want, I want, I really want my channel to be about fun things like um, salads, eating, mukbang, makeup, just life. Um, I'm also taking you guys on my journey. I have a hair company it's called Leticia Precious Luxuries. And um, it's my baby. And we are thriving and growing. You know? And I don't mind sharing my experience with you guys, you know? I'm just going to use half of this onion. I'm not going to use all of it. With a salad. Oh, the thing is shaking you guys. like I'm half going through a tornado. But yeah, you know, um Yeah, so you guys are more than welcome to go on my journey with me. Um I know I'm bored and tired of being in the house as we all are. And I'm just over it. Now, as I said, I like my food flavorful. I want to taste the crunch. And it also, it adds the, um, I think it says, look, I'm crying. I think the box says that, I mean, the ingredients says for one box. I made two boxes. So I'm going to pause you guys and I'm going to dice this up. I guess y'all could shake if you guys are shaking. It doesn't matter. I don't know. But you dice this up like this. You guys aren't really messy, so. But I promise my food be really good. So we're gonna put this to the side. I clean the table off, so I don't talk about it. So we're gonna sit this right here to the side. We're gonna take the bell pepper. Let's rinse it off.
the rest of all. What kind of chocolate is she doing? It works in the day. You're green pepper because I, it this is gonna overpower this is gonna overpower this yeah you don't want your pepper onion to overpower you know your green peppers because you want the flavors you want to taste them strategy. We're going to check on our noodles. Our noodles are done. cut up our tomatoes you guys I'm making literally everything with you guys you guys are we are really gonna eat this in my house tonight <laughs> you guys are really a part of it so yeah as I was telling you earlier that um I'm sorry I'm bouncing around but as I told you guys earlier um take you guys I started a business my little hair business and i'll take you guys on the journey with me if you have any questions if you have anything i did rinse these by the way um if you have any questions if you want to know anything um i did my llc on my own when i first started out i thought of the ein number came with llc which it didn't and I just educated myself because I was giving out false information and I educated myself on it more. And as I got more educated, I said that I would share the information I've learned thus far because it was so hard for me to find people that will do the same for me. So, that's what I did. Okay, so our noodles are done. Now that our noodles are done, I'm gonna use the strainer and I'm gonna put, um, I'm gonna use the strainer and I'm gonna pour the noodles in the strainer. Hey, Tammy. Hey, Really? You cut 
could hold my camera for me if I knew. Okay, these are the noodles that we just cooked. Put this over there for me. These are the noodles that we just cooked. We're gonna place them in here. Okay, so we placed our noodles in here. And we have a big bowl. This is two, two packets. So, what we're going to do is we're going to take these off at this point. And we're going to get a smaller knife. Can you give me some big Complete season. Okay, so the complete season is in the cabinet. Okay, you guys, so um, we're going to take um, this parsley and basil. We're just going to sprinkle. Complete seasoning on it. That's a tangible That was kind of dangerous. Dangerous, dangerous, dangerous. Isn't a tri color noodle pretty? So we're going to sprinkle this in here like this. But this bag, not so much. Put a little complete seasoning. Um, can you give me a little bit of season salt? Just a little, a little, 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 a little. And we're gonna put this in there. We can put a little. Laurie is, this is Laurie. It is uh, salty. It says Laurie salt. People think this is seasoning. No, it's not. It's salt. You know? Here, let's Angela put it back, please. Then after that. Okay, there you go. So you guys can see what's going then you're gonna put this. Can you give me a spoon or something? A big one. Then we're gonna stir this up. Mm -hmm. The seasons that we have for Remember, I told you guys I'm doing this to my liking and how I like it. Now, what gave me an idea was I seen it and I'm just like, we're home. So, you just get tired of eating the same thing. You can't go anywhere. You can't do anything. You just got to get tired of eating the same thing. Okay, now we're going to take our olives. We're going to drain these. Can you drain this for me, please? Mm -hmm. Just hold it down like that and drain it. Can you do this for me, too? I don't want to break the nails. The nail shop doesn't open. This is literally taking me 19 minutes. Everything you see is everything I've done with you guys here. So this is how simple and easy this is. So you're going to take that and you're going to toss it inside your olives. After you do that, you're going to take your other olives and toss them inside.
I'm gonna take your assembly your heads up with this cross the inside. sides. You take your um, tomatoes and you're gonna take your onions and toss them inside. Look how pretty. Isn't that pretty? It's so simple. And then you just mix it up. Mix everything. Oh, that's so pretty. I need more tomatoes. I'm gonna cut up more tomatoes. Put the rest of those in there. This um, salad also calls for mozzarella balls. You guys, I finally got me some foundation from Fenty. I ordered it. And she, it came with a free lipstick. Yeah. Oh, look at that. Look at that. Look at that. Look at that. Ooh. -hoo. Now you're going to put your towel dressing in there. Hey, baby. You want to plate? This is what the olives came in. I'm gonna do it with that first. The only thing I've added different from the ingredients is I'm gonna add shrimp. At this point, I just squeeze the whole thing in there. Okay. 
Now we're gonna put our cheese balls in our mozzarella balls. We're gonna put them in there now. I just went ahead and I dumped this whole thing in there. That's all I'm gonna put. The well, just about almost full. This is 187 at Walmart. Um, the ounces, it's 15 full ounces. Okay, so we're gonna see how many balls come in here. I never knew what my mom buys these all the time, but okay, so I'm not trying to cut myself. I'm not trying to cut myself. Cause that's gonna hurt me to do. Mozzarella cheese balls. It's only four in here, but they come in different. Um, I can't believe four cheese balls come in that container for um yeah and I couldn't find any small ones so I'm gonna take the big ones and chop them up into little pieces. I made three rolls out of a slice. And you see how you can see the chunks of the salad? That's how it is on the on the ingredients on the picture. This is something simple you can make for the kids really fast. You can have it hot or cold. It's totally up to you and how you feel as though this should be for you. Now, I like mozzarella cheese, so I'm going to take another cheese ball. I'm going to split one ball at least five times and make slices out of them. I think I almost got my finger. Yes. So I'm going to use this one, smaller, smaller knife. See how many times I cut that? One, two, three, four, five. Then I'm going to take it, one, two, three. Take that, slice it down the middle. Bam. That's done. Repeat that. One, two, three, four. Split down the middle. Chop. Split down the middle. Chop. 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 Like that. We're done with these cheese balls. This is what they look like. All right. Then we're gonna come over here. The shrimp are already cooked. I'm gonna add this to my menu like for 
Oh, I'm sorry. I want to this because I need really like for um, Christmas and just like something quick to invite a friend over. You know, it, it could be quick. You and your girlfriends get together. It's nothing big. Yeah. Mm. I think I'm going to put about... We're going to rinse these off, you guys. I don't want to take a plate. I can use a little cup. I'm sorry, I don't have the fancy things. I'm like, do it yourself. Get it in go pot. So we have one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, twelve, thirteen, fourteen, fifteen shrimp. Um, I think that's kind of robbing, but I think I want to put all of them in there. You think they're too big? I kind of do. No, I'm gonna leave my shrimp whole. I like mine like that. Cause when I eat my salad, I like for it. You know how you, oh, it's seafood and you be pinching. Mm -mm. Nope. And I'm gonna put the rest of these shrimp in there. And that is going to be that. And I'm gonna show you guys our salad and we made it. You guys made it here with me. This was a 30 minute process, nothing hard. And the only reason it was 30 minutes is because I'm explaining. Nothing hard, I just um, learned how to do this off of, my mom has her own way where she put seafood, she put shrimp, lobster, crab meat, like she put all the meats in there. Um, like I said, this is a pound of shrimp. I'm just gonna go ahead and put the whole pound in there all of the day and our salad is done and it looks nice Doesn't this look delicious? Simple, easy. You guys can do this with your eyes closed. Yes. Give you guys a close up. You guys could, this, you guys will. I don't know how to turn it around. I know I'm not crazy. So, look at that. Look at the shrimp, the tomatoes. The shrimp, the tomatoes, the onions, the cheese, the olives, the bell pepper. Oh, it's gonna be so good. Well, I couldn't figure out how to turn my camera on. But yeah, thank you guys for watching. I hope and pray that you guys stay safe during the coronavirus. I pray for my family to yours, that you guys just continue to pray, press forward, keep the faith. Don't be so drained out with the news and terrified. You know, just channel your energy somewhere else and be positive. Be blessed. Thank you guys for watching.